We also have known about this for a while. We have, we have, but it was in, in Mexican, Spanish. No, it wasn't. <laughs> oh, it was no. in English. Now it's in English. I'm sorry, guys. When it comes to Spanish numbers, I can't identify it. They just look we, so we've similar. We've had this particular image for a while. This is you. Shut up. Okay, for a smile. Which? Oh my God, that is a, such a great name. So this has the most precious smile. When the lolly smiles at you, it captures your heart. Uh, as if he has the worst smile here. Nah, actually, Jafar does. Anyways, <laughs> for a smile. Aw, oh, she looks so cute. I love her. I love Sothis. Okay, bonus allies are, of course, Dual Marth, Christmas Sothis. Yeah, and Christmas of Fjall. It still feels bad the same. And Christmas Nino. This is actually such an insane battle. If you get one of these heroes and you just all about um, Tempest Trials, you should do really well until you fight. That's right, you fight Sothis at the end of this. None of these guys do good against Sothis. Nope. Holy crap. Not Christ. one. <laughs> well, maybe Zephyr. Is, but he's slow. He is slow. But he has good res. He has good res. Okay. 40. Right at the onset. Okay. And so then, of course, Marth. <laughs> kind of. Marth, kind of. I think he's in trouble because if he touches Sothis, it's special fighter. Dudes. Yeah. And they have, like, no. equal speed, essentially. Yep. Okay, well, that's awkward. And Nino, oh, let's not even talk about that. My girl is screwed. Yeah, you're plum screwed if you run Nino. Though, interesting, interestingly enough, the one hero that might be decent here is is Jafar. Actually, Sothis would be de decent well, but Jafar would be decent. Jafar would be pretty serviceable here. Serviceable here. Which is all you can ask for since he's free. <laughs> yeah, no kidding. And of course, normal Jafar. Oh god, no, normal Jafar versus <laughs> this. Oh god, no. Uh uh, no. Hey, Don't Marth. even try. No, that's your savior there, Marth. Your 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 bonus hero, guys. Run Marth. Run Marth for your life. Yep. He's the only thing that can reasonably kill Sothis. He's your only hope. And of course, Lion, you know. Which still has the same issue, because I think she can't double. I don't think she can double Sothis. Winter no. Sothis, guys. Especially with extra BST. No. Oh. Hell no. <laughs> Alright, but yeah, and then she also has DC, and, and Nino's defense is ridiculously low, so she might get one-shotted. So, oh my goodness, this is actually a fairly challenging Tempest Trials, just because Sothis is ridiculous. Yeah, without even looking at the map, I'm already gonna... Tempest Trials. Yes, and you guys gotta remember, Sothis, her, she has enhanced BST because you're fighting her in Tempest Trials, and because you are likely to run your first battle in the day at the highest difficulty, and then you gotta factor in her weapon, and then of course Sirius, and then Special Fighter so you don't get to get your specials, and she has DC, and she has Threatened Attack Res, so if you tried baiting her, oh god. Oh, uh, hmm. we'll wait until you see the map. Oh wait, they might have changed her kit. Alright, well we'll talk about that in a moment. Anyways, the skills, the seals are warding blow three. Why not? Who the hell would use that? Uh, it's the least useful blows. It's yeah. just there to be there. By the way guys, armor blow actually made some sense because you would run armor blow on like Halloween Mer, and then it would actually allow her to double, which is weird because it's more defense, but she will double if she has more defense than her opponent. Yeah, it actually had a use that was practical. Yeah, maybe... Flora? No, Flora doesn't really do that. No, Flora works off her visible. Silk? Silky? Uh, Silky, I think, also works off visible. What the... F what is that for, then? It's there to be tankier. Like, if you're running an impact, you could probably synergize that. I guess. Oh wait, we're wrong. Cause she doesn't count as a dragon, so Marth doesn't do shit. Oh god. Yeah, yeah, that's why I'm I was sorry. saying like Marth is just a red unit. She doesn't. Have, he doesn't have anything inherently right. Actually, he's still your best hope because he's just a red unit, and there's nothing. Yeah, exactly. There's nothing else. Like, it's just the fact that he's red. All their effort. This is gonna be a hard GT. Yeah, I'm not expecting this GT to be very easy. Guys, you gotta remember, but she, she again, heals. Again, huh? the, unit. the unit itself, though. Yeah. But, <sighs> Grace. 
I mean, guys, TT can only get so hard because we're only talking about the final boss. Everything else before that was whatever, but still. This is one of the more tougher ones. Nice double positive. Okay, now we have Study Posture too, which is actually a really good skill. I like Study Posture. There's a lot of heroes that use it really well. Yeah, um, you, like even more recently, uh, what's his face? Ozian has Mirror Stance 3. You run that with Steady Posture, and now you have a plus, plus in all your it? stats, and then, in, well, plus 4 to its speed, speed death, plus 6 to attack res. Oh, okay, whatever. <laughs> yeah, and then also Guard. So you run Mirror Stance to Steady Posture, Omni Stance, or you can stack Steady Posture on Steady Posture through Racing. Yeah, steady posture, double steady posture is actually really good. A lot of heroes have like decent speed, decent defense, like Black Knight, for example. Mm -hmm. All right, distant guard three though. Ooh, yeah, Ooh, that's that, pretty good. That's a good seal. Why is that yeah. a good seal, guys? Because like ether raids or whatever, you can have your your tanky hero get backed up with extra defense and res when attack. Yep. And if you really want to get crazy, synergize it with the uh, distant guard weapon, which I think is Renea's. Renea's um, silver goblet has oh. distant guard in it. So oh. you run distant guard from on yeah, distant guard um, Renea, and then you run the distant guard seal. You're giving a passive plus twelve def res Ooh. to range. Okay, yeah, 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 stuff like that, guys. Distant guard is actually a pretty good seal. So this, this, the, the two best seals, steady posture, distant guard, warning blows. Oh, yeah. I, I have no idea what to do with that. That is point. It's a pointless seal, realistically. Chat, you want to realize how weird it would be to use warning blow? Because warning blow, like heroes you fight that would attack you back with magic, are dragons, which would target lower defense or res. Awkward. So this, it might not even do anything. Mm -hmm. Or you fight like um, another mage, but mages usually have pretty good res anyways. So you might just. It might not even matter. So. Yep. Weird. Okay. Finally, let's look at the actual map. Oh no! They, did, they she lost her kit, so everything we said didn't matter. <laughs> yeah, that's why I was saying. No. Okay, we gotta amend everything we said earlier. Is. Is didn't have it in them. Yeah, they didn't want another picnic flora, so they went way under. Oh my God! They nerfed her to all oh, heck. Now, our, now yeah. people will rewind this in the comment section and tell me I'm stupid. Well, guys, I did look at this first, and I thought IS finally grew the balls to run a difficult, difficult battle. I mean, another one. Again, Picnic Floor was actually pretty hell. Yeah, that's because Picnic they Floor kept her kit. Yep. If they kept, the so if this is kit, you touch her, serious back. She has distant counter. At least now you can hit her from afar. Fuck. Yep. They kept the, her, her. I guess she still has nose grace and serious, but the least meaningful skill is her C skill, and that's only. Mm hmm. Oh, IS. No. You know, guys, if it isn't obvious, IS is allergic to difficulty, so. <laughs> it's one of the reasons so the why players. very few things are tough in this game, but. So are the players, to be fair. <laughs> well. I mean, this is for, for mostly for casual Fire Emblem fans. Don't take it the wrong way, guys. This is the truth. Yeah. Okay. In terms of Sothis, 70 HP. At least that's high. 50 attack. I guess it's like Bad. 55, I guess. That's actually lower. <laughs> what? That's lower than a normal attack stat. What the fuck? She's supposed to have 51. Ah, yes. I can't <clears throat> believe you, ah, yes. You would even take away one attack. Ugh, okay, 43 speed, 28 defense, 33 res. Does that look right? E what? No, it doesn't I didn't look even right. Look her. She's way less bulky. What the hell? Did... <laughs> they nerfed her step. They nerfed Why her would you nerf res. her? Boost her. I mean, she's faster. What? Wait, no, she isn't. She has 41 base. So no, she... Snow's Grace is speed plus three, so she's just minus one, minus one, minus two, minus two. What the fuck? What uh, are you doing? <laughs> they really didn't want Sothis. <laughs> IS is allergic to difficulty. IS is allergic. Every players are also. 
Uh, well, I guess the player is to a certain degree, but like, come on, this is stupid. You had a good TT hero. You just had to do nothing at all, and she would have been good. She would have been hell. Ugh. <laughs> I would have been like, that's a TT ender right there. Well, chat, I take it back everything I said. Hell, even Nino's would do good because she can't counterattack now. Yep. Uh, well. The only thing difficult is if you run in auto battle and run in and hit her because she has attack defense spawn. But let's be, let's be serious. Like, it, it might not even matter. It's just five extra attack and defense. Pretty much. I guess Snow's Grace will still trigger, so she gets plus five to everything. I guess. But... And if you melee her, she does still get serious eventually. Uh, well, that is still forty-eight speed. <laughs> it it is still something, but it could have been a lot more. Yeah. It could have been hell on earth instead. It's just a mild inconvenience. Mild inconvenience. The mild inconvenience type of trials. All right, guys. And finally, her stats. Oh, sorry. It starts on the 17th and it goes to 27th. So 10 days. Yep. As always. Anyways, good luck on the Tempest Trials, guys. But you don't need it. It's not actually going to be difficult. 